What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. We are on day four of the Choreo Bikini Challenge at home training program. So if you've made it this far, I'm so excited for you. Today's gonna be a great workout. We're doing upper body. Now I'm only gonna be using two dumbbells for this workout because I know that a lot of us don't have that much equipment at home. So feel free to work out along with me. I'm gonna go through the entire workout without rest because that's how I designed the program. And then after we're done with the entire circuit, you're gonna rest one to two minutes and then rewind this video and repeat it three times, three times total. So without further ado, let me breeze through the how-to of each exercise and then we will start our workout. The first thing we're gonna do is warm up, body weight kind of dynamic stretches. Then we're gonna do the single arm row with your dumbbell. So you just take it like this, nice athletic stance, and you're gonna pull your dumbbell close to your body, keeping your elbow tucked in to the side and your shoulder blade retracted down. Don't let your shoulder creep up. Then we're gonna do the same thing, burn it out with two dumbbells. Then we're gonna do an, a double overhead tricep extension. So I recommend using dumbbells that are fairly light because since we're not resting until it's all over, it could get pretty hard. So we're gonna do double tricep overhead extension. Then we're gonna do push-ups. Y'all know how to do those. Um, alternating dumbbell curls, pretty self-explanatory. Um, single arm tricep extension, just one side. Alternating hammer curls. And then we're gonna do squat and press. So when you do your squat and press, you're gonna hold your dumbbells up like this, press it over your head. Like so. Then we're gonna do a lying overhead crunch. So you're gonna take one or two dumbbells, depending on how feisty you're feeling. Fly on the ground. And we're gonna do crunch. Nice and slow. And don't let that dumbbell hit the ground on your way down. Lastly, we're gonna finish it off by doing five minutes of jump roping. You don't have to do the jump roping, you can do it at the end, but the way I designed the program is for you to do 20 minutes of hit cardio today. So I personally like to break it up five minutes between each round of exercises. You can totally do it at the end as well. So without further ado, let's get started.
guys, done with round one. So if you are doing your cardio at the end, rewind this video, do that entire thing three more, three times total, so two more times, or you can do an extra one if you wanna push yourself. Otherwise, join me for this five minutes of jump roping. You could also do sprints or run the stairs in your home or do some sort of hit style cardio. So I'm gonna do those five minutes now and I'll see you after.
All right, guys, that brings us to the end of our workout. Make sure you repeat that three times total for the full thing, and I will see you tomorrow. Thanks so much, guys. See you soon.